We wanted really to make something special. I think it's going to create a new way of using the car, a new way of using mobility. My name is Thomas Pinel. I'm interior designer by Audi. This car is full of surprises. When you start to use it, then you understand why we did it like that. We had a lot of thinking, a lot of brainstorming at the beginning. What could it be and how the electric car for Audi should look? My name is Vladimir Matzon. I'm the interface designer at Audi Design. We came to the theme of sounds of silence. Electric car, you have no engine noise, so it gives you new freedoms. And we wanted to interpret it somehow into the design. You have completely different emotion in this car. It's still a strong car. It has an amazing performance. It's like beautiful contrast between this huge power and this silence. We have very fast lines. This car is definitely a sport SUV. And at the same time, we bring a lot of elegance in it. This is a car that we have to use. It's a car that has to be really comfortable. We were definitely searching for the new identity for the electric cars. We were also inspired by this new technology, you know. You have this electric power, which is huge power. We wanted to have a special signature. It's a lighted signature. It's really telling you that you're getting inside this electric world. We have a very horizontal line. It's also a support with light. And this line, it's also kind of a, the horizon for our interior. Over this line is also the driving instrument. Underneath, it's more multimedia. It's uh, what is sharing the, with the passenger. And I really like it because it makes this interior really clear. The shifter of Audi e-tron is completely new. It's integrated and it's floating. It's a part of the middle console. It's from the structure of the console. It's not a separate island. The shifter itself is just a little trigger. The difference is you are not shifting with the whole hand mechanically, like in the combustion engine cars. You are just shifting with smooth movement of two fingers. It's part actually of our job to, to, to find the perfect balance between um, the use of the parts, the, uh, the technology, how we integrate it, and what we want to give to the people. I think at Audi, we are obsessed with making things perfect. In the end, we managed to make something which was impossible somehow possible.